Hey there OPL fans, it's Pyrotechnics here and well we're off to the second round robin looking forward to the last couple of weeks of play. So let's dive right in and see what we can expect from the teams fighting for the gauntlet. Let's take a look at the standings. Now these are the results after seven weeks of play. That's two round robins by the way, so everyone has faced off against everyone twice. With that, let's take a rundown of the teams. So let's start with the top of the table. Bombers and Chiefs are currently rocking it right now. For the Chiefs, no big surprises there. Everyone expected them to do well. Bombers, on the other hand, I don't think anyone quite expected them to be as unbeatable as they have been. Looking forward to seeing how they perform in the gauntlet. So the biggest surprise has been Avant Gaming. This team is kind of come out of nowhere. They have a rotating roster, which almost nobody else does. And even though it's been cool, I think they should stick with Swaith because he just seems pound for pound a better player. The champion choices they make, though, are the big thing. This team plays every champion under the sun and nobody can really prepare for them. So I expect some great things out of Avant come the gauntlet. Speaking of surprises, let's talk about one in the other direction. Mammoth were supposed to be the super team on top of the standings. However, they really stumbled out of the gates. They turned it around in the second round, Robin getting five wins in a row, which is absolutely fantastic. However, that was cut short in the last week. So we'll have to see which Mammoth comes to play in the final weeks and if they will get sent back to the Ice Age or make it through to the gauntlet. Order, okay, so They've had a very up and down split so far. Started out okay, after a 0-2 week they won a bunch of games and then it all came crashing down. So Order really need to pick some things back up. They won against the Direwolves last week and that's the bare minimum. But we'll see what they can do going forward. So it's hard to know where to rate Gravitas. They're a team that have had two 0 weeks, 0-2 weeks, 1-1 weeks, and even though their players are more or less known quantities, they really have a trouble beating the top tier teams. They've only really beaten the teams consistently that are below them in the standings. So I need to see a bit more from Gravitas before I'm convinced they're ready for the playoffs. All right, so now we get to the bottom of the table, Legacy Direwolves. Legacy are a team that have managed to scratch a couple of wins and they've had some creative gameplay. Chaz is definitely an emerging star. So maybe next split, but right now, not quite strong enough. Direwolves, they're needing a lot of work. This team definitely needs a lot more time to get it together and looking at next split, maybe next year. What do you guys at home think? Let us know with the hashtag IMOPL on Twitter. And don't forget the third round Robin, the last three weeks of play start this Friday, 4 p.m. AEDT. So make sure you tune in.